Hi, my name is Onza and welcome to Halo Infinite. In this video, I'll show you how to use the different weapons in Halo Infinite. It's going to be a multi-part sort of mini-series. I don't know why I always start mini-series, but in this video I'll be focusing on the assault rifles and carbines which means the MA-40 AR, the Pulse Carbine from the Covenant or Banished, the BR-75 Battle Rifle and the VK-78 Commando. So first, the MA-40 AR. I'll use the weapon drills to show it basically to you. And the MA-40 AR, I think it is. Yeah, it's the MA-40. The 3 zone is... Reach. Act fast, Spartan. 30 seconds remaining. I would recommend trying to just spray it. This is a more of a spray and pray weapon. But you have to keep your crosshair on enemies. The bloom works best when in short controlled bursts. Fantastic showcase of skill. So yeah, for the MA-40, use short bursts, but you can always use the full automatic thing and unload the whole magazine if you're in distress. A very versatile weapon. Now, the Pulse Carbine. This is a more of a confusing weapon. And some Halo fans say that they hate it. But it's not that bad. It's an energy weapon, so it's great against shields. And always fire it at the red reticle range. That way the... Plasma balls have tracking. And the tracking is actually quite good because it means if enemies are strafing, it works really well. And this is a burst weapon, so yeah, it's kind it's pretty easy to use if you know what you're doing. Now, for the BR-75, this is basically just the battle rifle, and yeah, it's a more of a long-range weapon, and it's great against... You can use it at any range, basically, but you should use it at close range if you have to, while strafing. Always try headshotting because this is a burst weapon. So, headshotting is the best. And reload often if you are dealing with a lot of enemies. And you can even fire it without being zoomed in. So yeah, BR, just fire it at a reasonable fire rate, do not just spam it, and keep the crosshair on the enemies, and strafe when using it at close range. Do not stand still with it, because then you're an easy target for a sniper. Now, the final one, the commando. This is a tough weapon to use, because... You should don't just spam fire someone, but you should tap fire it instead. But spam is good at ultra close range. So yeah, if you see, you can just slowly fire it in bursts. Short controlled bursts or Tap firing is ideal. 
Two shot bursts, for example. Great. Or you can just spam it. Spam spamming the commando is only good when at ultra close range when you know you will hit the enemy because at long range it the recoil is really strong on this weapon because it uses like larger ammunition so high, higher caliber always has like higher recoil unless you have a long barrel and muzzle brakes and it, all that sorts of fancy stuff so yeah tap fire it or in short bursts and don't spam it unless at cro close range so yeah that's going to be it if you enjoyed this video give it a like subscribe and see you in the domain